Hello everyone, and welcome to the Now Platform Washington DC release features. Just to do a quick intro here, my name is Carson Jones, and I'm a solution consultant here at ServiceNow, and I specifically focus on our IT asset management solution. And today, I'm gonna to be focusing on some enhancements to our software asset management solution from our Washington DC release. And this presentation may contain some forward-looking statements that reflect the current beliefs of ServiceNow and are based on the current information available. And these forward-looking statements should not be relied upon when making purchasing decisions. Within ServiceNow's software asset management solution, in the past, we've given customers a tool to be able to measure their SAM journey over time and really ensure that they're reaching maximized value within their SAM environment. And the success portal has and still will be an accurate place for our customers to go to to understand, hey, how are we maturing on the platform? Again, allowing our customers to set those same related success goals and determine what's next as they continue to strengthen their posture on the now platform. But now coming from our Washington DC release, our customers are given the tools to help manage you know, the same project management and the product adoption journey and the SAM program maturity tool is gonna give our customers the proper roadmap to continue to develop and mature their SAM posture in the Now platform and provide those best practices as they mature more and more. And this product feature gives customers a point in time evaluation of you know, their SAM program maturity using a crawl, walk, run method. It's gonna help our customers plan their next activities to continue to mature by leveraging you know, other tools within the success portal. So with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the instance to showcase what this looks like on the Now platform. So now we're in our actual instance here, and if we think about this from the lens of, say, an asset manager, the success portal is a place that we can come to really lean into, hey, how is our SAM program performing over time? And within this space, we're gonna get a quick snapshot of our SAM success journey and the goals that are performing around it in real time. We see some of those different widgets and reporting for things out of the box, like you know overall completed success goals up until this point. And with that, how much we've actually gone out and saved by going out and accomplishing what these goals entail and even starting to get visibility into all the goals that are in progress, again, ones that have been completed, and starting to look at the different projected savings by goals that we have written out that we're set to complete um, within a month or a yearly basis. We also have this value builder tab up here, which is going to give us more reporting around the you know, same maturity up until this point. So here it's, hey, out of all the you know, different software so management applications, how many plugins have we set up until this point? Or making sure that we're managing and have all those publisher packs set up that ServiceNow offers with our biggest vendors. And getting the option to actually go in and to create one of these value builder tasks for the things that are really gonna only help us be more mature within our SAM environment as we continue to grow on the platform. And again, from our Washington release, we have this SAM maturity tab here. And this is where we can start to come into to this particular spot and understand, okay, from a crawl, walk, run approach, what are some recommendations that we're giving out to our customers to really mature their SAM environment over time? So from a crawl approach, you know, identifying stakeholders or setting up those service graph connectors, enabling those SSO integrations. And as we move forward to, to walk here, the same idea is gonna go, um, but really this is gonna be that middle stage to where we've already set up all those initial integrations, all the crawl steps are completed, and now we can start to really progress into stage two and start to tackle any of those you know, walk maturity items that we're seeing here. And from a run approach, you know, understanding, hey, is there any overlapping software out in our environment that we can go out and consolidate down to? And you know, I obviously could come in here and move this to the crawl or walk stage if I wanted to. But all of this is really with the idea of you know understanding what's actually out in our environment and then having those tasks in place to really again mature our SAM environment over time. So I'll go ahead and jump into one of these maturity items, for example. So in this particular case, we have this overlapping software um, goal initiative here, and we can start to come in here and figure out what those high-level details are around it here, right? So from a purpose perspective, this is us going out and 
uncovering any software applications that are, are serving the same purpose and starting to rationalize those. And we can go ahead and add, you know, value builder tasks on top of this for whoever's going to be responsible for actually going out and, you know, making progress on this goal. But all of this is really with the idea, again, of having those proper steps in place and then being able to measure it over time. And from an executive lens, if we think about wanting to get more visibility into how our, our SAM you know, goals are performing over time, we can jump into this asset management executive workspace here. And this is where we can start to you know, understand across the organization, how many completed software success goals have we actually done up until this point of the year? And then starting to get visibility into you know, what the title of those was, what the goal description, and then starting to look at the financials of it. But that's going to be our success goals um, with the maturity feature that we rolled out with with Washington DC. So with that being said, I'll go ahead and jump back to the slides to close things out here. And this is going to conclude the high level overview for the new software asset management SAM program maturity access feature on the now platform for the Washington DC release of software asset management. You can find a full list of our new products and features to be found on our product documentation website at www.docs.servicenow.com. Thank you all for listening and don't forget to check out other release information from our Vancouver release videos.